Welcome back to another episode of the Cats Corner. I'm Casey Campbell, along with Novi head hockey coach Dane Baruzzini. Hey, Dane, how's it going? Going well, Casey. How are you? Doing well. So uh, before we start today's show, we have to thank our sponsor, Engrave It All USA. Michelle and her team can engrave just about anything in all different types of sizes as well. You can bring your items in that you already have, or they can make something completely from scratch. Remember, if you can dream it, they can laze it. Products they make include tumblers, sweatshirts, t-shirts, hats, and beanies, plus much, much more. Um, thank you to Engrave It All USA for sponsoring today's episode of the Cat's Corner. The link is below in the description. Um, all right. So uh, obviously, I think most have heard the news. So uh, um, with uh, with Novi's forfeit against Brighton. So I'm going to give you the floor, Dane. Yeah, thank you. Um, you know, unfortunately, we have a uh, do not compete um, on our record. We're not able to play against Brighton uh, tomorrow. Um you know, we had an incident as a team that, you know, does not meet Novi Community School District's code of conduct or the hockey team's code of conduct, um, which led in, you know, us having to um, suspend our team from our next home game, which happens to be, you know, tomorrow against the Brighton Bulldogs. Um, so, you know, we talked about it and, you know, our athletic department, our principal, our superintendent, and, you know, made the decision that as a team, you know, we would be suspended uh, for our next home game, which is Brighton. Um, I also sat out uh, Saturday's game against U of D uh, just based on, you know, our team not meeting our expectations, not meeting the school district's expectations or the elective department's expectations. And, um, you know, from here, you know, our expectation is we um, just conduct ourselves above the line and meet not only the expectations of our school district and our hockey program, but just as ourselves as individuals. Yeah. Um, just kind of talk about what this, uh, you know, this just this week has been like and uh, getting ready for a, um, and this week's game against Gladwin. Yeah, no, it's, um, you know, it's it's been a week, you know, if we, if we can talk about that. I mean, you know, we, you know, allowed we allowed an investigation for about a week as, you know, I brought up what we, what we noticed. Um, you know, let everybody kind of have their say, everybody got to speak to it. Um, so we were, you know, figuring out how to get through it, you know, found out, you know, what the final cause was. It's completely supported. Um, you know, it's always unfortunate to cancel a home game, but then, you know, now it's, you know, we have a snow day tomorrow. We have no activities, you know, we wouldn't have had the game, but we don't have a practice either. And then we're going to get back to work on Wednesday, uh, Thursday, and then, you know, have a game on Friday. Um, you know, our focus is, is to work really hard, um, be great teammates, be great in our community and, um, you know, just represent our school, our school district and our city with pride. And then just also, and then finally, what, um, uh, you know, what are these next few days going to be, um, you know, like for you guys as you got to try to get ready for this game? Yeah. Um, you know, I mean, tomorrow's a day of rust recovery. Um, you know, we played last week, we played Plymouth and, uh, U of D, uh, down seven guys, um, for injuries or for sickness. Um, so we're trying to, you know, get back on the right side of it, um, you know, competing against really good Plymouth team and then a really strong U of D team, with only 13 skaters is tough. Um, you know, so tomorrow, you know, we're just completely, you know, with the school, with the snow day, with no ice, just completely rest and relaxation, you know, physical and mental health day. Um, we'll come back at it Wednesday, try to get some good tempo, work on some puck movement, work on some high compete Thursday, get more into some, uh, you know, team play. And then Friday, be ready for a good Gladwin team. I mean, they've been winning a lot of games. They score a lot of goals. Um, you know, they're not just going to march in and let us beat them. So we're going to have to really work, uh, come together as a group and, you know, and, and beat a solid team that's traveling far to play us. All right. Dane, thanks so much for the time. We'll talk to you soon. Thanks, Casey.